In the Kijagi slum in Nairobi, Madeline Mukonyi is getting her daughter patients ready for school. Madeline is a single mother who raises two girls on a daily salary of two US dollars. You see my time. At her age, while I was at her age, I couldn't talk in English. I couldn't even read a book in English, but she does read. It used to be unthinkable for struggling families like Madeline's to send a child to a decent private school for less than $6 a month. Bridge International Academies have made it possible. It's a network of low-cost private schools established in Kenya in 2009. The concept is an academy in a box. It consists of a Nook tablet, which they call a teacher computer. Through it, bridge teachers receive their daily lessons from HQ. We have the teacher computer that really assists the teachers in delivering the content of the lesson in class. We also have uh, great materials in class to aid the pupils uh, learn best and faster. In order to ensure that every school has the same education, Bridge designs its curriculum at its HQ in Nairobi. The lessons are carefully plotted. They're stored on a server that can be accessed at every school by an academy manager. The teachers then come to the office to sync their tablets and tap in the curriculum of the day. I'm having a mobile app here and from this mobile app um, I can be able to look at pupils' billing history, um, check on teachers' evaluation, um, also, I can be able to ask for supplies through the vendor's button and um, I can be able to call headquarters during maybe one, two, three things of, in my academy. So technology has been used to sum up almost everything in all Bridge International schools around Kenya. The school network's goal is to make money by expanding its standardised internet-based education model. For Shannon May, one of the three co-founders of the Bridge, quantity can go along with quality. Today we are having a visitor in our class. He has a jar of sweets. Many people think that if you have scale, you can't possibly have quality. But that's uh, a mistake. If you have the systems in place, you have the technology in place, you have the rigor, you uh, require the accountability of all of your staff, you encourage the participation of parents, then scale is a good thing. It actually helps you amortize the cost of all those investments over a larger population, keep your prices low, and ensure more children benefit. Since its launch six years ago, Bridge has established more than 400 schools in Kenya, enrolling more than 126,000 students. It also has schools up and running in Nigeria. Its vision, to expand schools in many parts of the world and reach 10 million children by 2025.